Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you are in the world. It is your girl, Kiki Perez, aka Empower Your Mind, and we are going to be doing a very much needed love reading. Now, I don't know, I randomly just felt the need to do this reading. So if you guys are having trouble in your love life, definitely pay attention. I do feel like this is a personal reading for someone listening. I honestly have no idea what I'm about to say, but whatever comes out my mouth, I'm gonna run with it, okay? I'm, I'm over here spitting bars. I'm free styling like a motherfucker. Anyway, this is kind of general, but at the same time, I feel like it is something specific for someone. I feel like a individual is definitely in um, the moment of having to make a serious decision. I think you have the decision to either stay in your current situation or you have the opportunity to move into something new now while i do feel that moving forward is going to be what's best for you i'm also getting the feeling that this particular individual is not going to welcome this new opportunity because they are afraid of change the message for you is you need to definitely be true to your feelings your emotions you have to like really live in that moment you're not going to be able to move forward unless you just make that decision like okay you know what i have to do this even if i feel some type of way about my spouse it isn't working or even if they're not even they don't have to be a bad person it could just be the point that they are not working for you or you are not working for them and that's absolutely okay if you guys are not growing together, you're going to grow apart, okay? I do feel like for some of you, there is going to be some type of family changes. Now, if this is not quite your situation, there is another story that I'm feeling. Somebody has, somebody either is being left, I think, or or you, or someone did leave you, okay? Um, I feel like if you are a male, I feel like if you are a male, you were left, Okay. And for some of you, it could just, it could be that you are female and a male left you, but I feel like a child or children were taken away. Okay. And I'm being told that you guys definitely need to forgive um, the person because they were only doing what was best for them. I feel like a lot of you are in separation from someone who could be your true love and is due to um like a, a work situation so maybe they are having to leave or relocate for um for a job i do feel like some of you were given the opportunity to make a move and you decided not to do that and you want to keep you know um you want to stay back and deal with the situation that you have that honestly is a toxic toxic situation some of you may be addicted to um, these toxic cycles okay you're holding on to your past it gets you super emotional you know you're reminiscing or reminiscing or however you guys say that you guys know what the fuck i'm trying to say but i feel like you really need to get some mental clarity and you need to strengthen um your mind because this is not the situation for you now let me go ahead and get some cards for you guys i mean i like you know i like freestyling coming off with so on my mind i'm gonna use the spiritual deck real quick and i just want to ask what do we need to know what's a message for someone reading i'm sorry not reading listening to this audio what is a message that we have for someone okay we have many possible outcomes that come up guys many possible outcomes that is there could be many solutions there could be many obstacles the choice is the choice is yours but you need to trust yourself now this is the uh my power card my strength card okay all right and then we also have the hangman what the fuck are you waiting for okay um the hangman is i'm sorry my out with the old is my power card for hangman so out with the old what does that mean let go okay and then we also have health check and this is in reverse so some of you guys are not putting yourself first you are not indulging in self-care as you should and then we have my kiki speaks card so that's clarification whoever 
needs to really hear this, don't be mad at me. I'm just a messenger, okay? I'm just the vessel. But pulling this Kiki card, when I see this Kiki Speaks card, it just lets me know that I'm speaking that motherfucking truth. It's the truth that you need to hear, okay? Some of you guys may have some type of narcissistic type of situation going on. You might be manipulated into staying. This could be the situation with the kids. Maybe you're staying because... Um, there's kids involved and then in the end you still gonna be left okay but I do feel like in the end you're going to win it's either going to be voluntarily or involuntarily because we have this free at last card which is my power card for the tower so there's going to be some super significant life changes coming you guys either want to make the decision yourself or you want to get that ash drag because the universe is not playing with you right now i feel like a lot of you are repeating these cycles and you're repeating these cycles because you are not putting the effort to do what's best for you okay we have my new phone who is this now this is letting you know there's going to be some new beginnings if you're able to let go you're going to be able to heal from the past if you put yourself in the position to grow you may be dealing with a person who's super jealous again this jealousy card comes up yeah your partner is probably super jealous super manipulative um and again we have my what to expect what's expect when expecting so that's my pregnancy card could mean an actual birth um, you're giving birth or you just found out you're pregnant. It could be a person that has lost, um, you know, due to business situation. So maybe some of you guys are dealing with the partner who is choosing their work over you. Um, but yeah, this is crazy how accurate these shits are, but in the end you are going to win. I pulled the trophies. Okay. This is major goals accomplished. These are major achievements. You guys definitely are going to go through a process with the cry me a river card, but it's okay. You will get through your depression. You'll get through your loneliness. You just have to make sure that you are focused on that health check and this mental awareness card that's coming up. Now we have the engagement and marriage card in reverse okay so there won't be any commitments there won't be any great partnerships there won't be any proposals with this toxic situation we have changing your mind in reverse this is also a card for me um wow oh i read that wrong i'm sorry guys it's my relocation card wow okay and that that's crazy i don't know i wrote a note on the back of my card and it literally says changing your mind this is weird Anyway, that was a message for someone. This is a relocation card. So somebody is moving on, okay? Somebody is moving on or somebody is traveling, all right? And again, we have your treat yourself right and keep it tight card, okay? Shout out to Just Ask Deb on Instagram. You guys need to go give her a follow. She is super dope. Tell her Kiki sent you, okay? Let her, get her, her, her follows up. But she came up with this. Treat yourself right and keep it tight. And this is my self-care and self-love card. So again, there's a second confirmation, all right? And then we have the butterfly effect. Now, you guys know, any situation that you're doing right now, whether it's super, super small, is going to have a major effect in your future. All the decisions that you're making right now is going to drastically affect your future. So you need to make the right decisions right now, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and pull just a couple more cards. Crazy, 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 okay? mental abuse you are definitely dealing with someone who is not <laughs> leave them alone no shade to anyone because at the end of the day i can understand but just because you understand what the end of you understand what a person is going through doesn't mean that you have to withstand what that person is going through you do not need to be in an abusive relationship whether it's emotional mental or physical you're better than that do not settle for what you don't deserve and you need to focus on your self-care and your self-love. We got the cash flow card, okay? So some of you guys may be feeling like um, this person holds money over you, okay? Or they could be putting their money first. We also have frenemies or nah, all right? That card to me in this reading is you got some fake lovers going around you. You also got some fake friends some fake friends and then we have wow the clean up woman all right now in this situation okay y'all know the song and the clean up woman okay go ahead and read them lyrics on that song all right we got some third party situations going on okay 
somebody is nurturing your man so you might as well just go on about your business and we have my i ain't no dummy that is my full power card okay take a risk take a leap of faith there are new beginnings go and do your shit we also have ambitious vision okay that is my star card you guys whoever this message is for y'all got somebody that's waiting for you to love you to care for you to cherish you and you are too scared to take that risk and take that leap of faith because you worrying about this toxic situation we got new horizon okay that is the sun card could be oh my gosh look the sun come on now what you guys think about when you think about the sun bright days warmth beauty beach relaxation all right you got a sun coming into your life all right but guess what we got the yes in reverse all right so everything that you ask for isn't on the way because you asking for the wrong shit you're not going to be guided to your right your true purpose because you're not focused on you okay we also have you cannot make this shit up all right and that is letting me know that major life changes are on the verge for you all right it's really up to you now we got catch flights that's in reverse all right that's my vacation card that's my traveling card that's my relationship but you can't catch feelings you know catch flights don't catch feelings but that's in reverse so some of you may make the decision to what not go you this person may not you know you might not want this person to relocate or that person may relocate and you're not going to worry about it you're not going to go with them you're going to let them go okay wow oh my god y'all i'm just done with this deck bitch don't kill my vibe okay toxic energy is near it don't get no real than that but then we got the golden ticket in reverse that is my power card for the wheel of fortune now some of you are not going to complete your cycles you're not going to accomplish your goals why because you're stuck on stupid i said what i said stop thinking about other people you need to focus on you all right and then i got my toys r us kid card okay in this situation you're dealing with someone who is not growing you're dealing with a childish or immature person or you're dealing with a situation that surrounds your kids okay and then we have the moon card eyes wide open that's my moon card there's some secrets going on here that you may have found out already but you're not using your intuition you need to trust your intuition okay there's some secrets going here it could be dealing with a per side piece could be a pisces okay and then we got the i can period card in reverse so you guys are just you're not in that leadership role you're not a leader of nobody you're not even a leader to yourself focus on your self-care okay and then we have this men are from mars but what women are from venus and venus what it rules what are our, our love and we have the high priestess okay so you guys are going to get in the energy of following your intuition okay know your power know that your powers are strictly infinite i mean i mean when i say strictly for you strictly for you right now only about you and i know i'm ranting but this is a message that needed to come through and y'all know what the fuck i'm trying to say pillow talk much needed family conversations okay it's time for you to speak up okay and i'm gonna just ask for one more card because geez what's the outcome what is the outcome this message who is this for because if this is your story y'all need to hit me up empower your mind podcast okay so that's one of my cards in my deck when this card comes up i always tell people to go look listen to my empire your mind podcast just click on whatever episode you see and there is a message there for you i definitely recommend that like that's crazy that that will come up and then in the end we have the big bang which is my world car okay things are going to come full circle for you guys if you decide to trust your intuition if you decide to manifest shit for yourself stop doing them love spells them domination spells for a person that don't give a shit about you you're gonna mess some stuff up okay don't be scared stop being lazy do the work let go of the excuses because you got a person 
I feel like celebrity status. I feel like if you let go of this toxic situation, you're going to go into exactly what this card says, fame and fortune. You're going to be coming into some successful ideas. You're going to have a fortunate turn of events and it's going to land you in a massive amount of windfalls. But that is only if you decide to commit and say yes to yourself. As usual, as always, it is your girl Kiki Perez, aka Empower Your Mind, and I'm out.